This is the eighth of a series and the last of short videos discussing big data. They're designed for those looking for a high-level view of this space. My name is Kathy Chung and I will be discussing opportunities and challenges in big data in the next couple of minutes. From Strata Data Conference 2013, I noticed several growth drivers for big data. There's increased awareness of big data and its benefits. There's increased investments in big data infrastructures by companies. There's better developed and more mature big data technologies. And there's increased number of system integration companies and offering expanded services to enable adoption. A couple of trends are also apparent. The big data and Hadoop space is getting more recognized, more fragmented, and more interesting. There's also real-time interactive querying needs from customers that have invited a number of players to come into the space. However, big data is still in early adopter phase. Enterprises lack skill sets, they lack and they resist to adoption of big data analytics-driven decision-making. There's a number of them waiting for winners to emerge from the fragmented platform's landscape. They're unclear about the ROI or return on investment of big data as vendors are focused on selling technology. There's also waiting for the opportunities to build enterprise-ready applications. Adoptions can be seen from both bottom-up and top-down. Revenues of big data are led by established companies such as HP and IBM. They're helping to drive enterprises to cross the chasm from the bottom. Service companies, service integration companies, are driving adoption from the top by continuing to focus on use cases and proof of concepts. So what does this mean? This means big data market will grow significantly in 2013. Market size will approach $50 billion by 2017. Technology winners will take time to surface and adoption of big data applications will be impacted by the technology fragmentation. I've been active in the big data space, strategizing, building, and expanding partner ecosystems for a number of companies. There's no question that opportunities are vast and challenges are plenty. If you'd like to discuss further, feel free to reach out. Thank you for listening, and this completes this series of short videos on big data.